Today, 10 shopping secrets Walmart does not want you to know. In fact, this is something only a Walmart employee might know. I am the deal guy, Matt. Granted, I am not an employee. I am an insider and I'm here to put more cash back in your wallet where it belongs. I did a piece not too long ago where I explained the 10 things I would never buy at Walmart. So if you saw that video, welcome back. If you're a subscriber, great to be with you. If you're new, subscribe, turn your notifications on and I'm going to put more cash back where it belongs and that is in your wallet. Before we get to Walmart and what I would buy and what not to buy and all these secrets, a reminder that I store my best shopping secrets on mattsdailydeals.com. If you're looking for anything from deals to what not to buy, what to avoid, it is all here, including how to instantly make your Wi-Fi speed faster. I do use affiliate links, which means I benefit monetarily if you're kind enough to use some of my links. Let's start with secret number one and that is freebies. Before this new normal, a lot of us would walk around to sample stands in Walmarts and grab as many samples as we could possibly gain. And you might not know this, you can actually now do this digitally and all of the free samples you pick up online or with the correct voucher will score you that item at a Walmart. You can even research in advance and this is called free OSC. So you enter your zip code and you can see what's sampling. And just as an example, whether it's Walmart or Sam's Club, uh, for example, Gain Fireworks Dish Detergent is available as a freebie. And Arm & Hammer Clean and Simple Detergent is available at Walmart. And you can find more freebies just based on what zip code you put in. So that is the first thing. This is a free OSC. The link to this website is on mattsdailydeals.com. Speaking of freebies, shopping secret number two is that if you are a new parent or you're about to give birth to another member of your household or you simply want free baby stuff, Walmart offers a free welcome box to any new parent. Now you need to sign up to receive your baby registry with a specific link, which I've listed on mattsdailydeals.com. But it is absolutely awesome when you are setting up a registry that you can score free diapers, free cream and all sorts of bath products that you would otherwise be spending your hard earned money on. Secret number three is that Walmart uses a very specific numbering pattern to let its staff and its internal numbering system know when an item is at a final markdown price. Prices that end in seven display the item's original price. So for example, this Lasco 20 inch air circulator ends in a seven. Although they list a list price of $59.99, that's basically just the MSRP. And since this is an only at Walmart product, it would be virtually impossible for you to price compare this exact model somewhere else. But the seven means that this is in fact their original price. And if this price were to, for example, change to something that ends in a five, that would be a whole different ball game. Products that end in a five, as you can see, signify an item's first markdown. So that's why we're seeing rollback on this. And regardless of what the list price is, do not base your life around assuming an MSRP or a list price is what the product ever sold for. That five is key though, that lets you know that this is part of reduction number one. For prices that end in one or zero, that signifies the item's final markdown. So let's take a look at the six gallon air compressor right now. List price of 336,209. I've been watching this for an extended period of time. This is the lowest price you are likely to see, at least in terms of how Walmart follows its pricing patterns. Secret number four is that Walmart is more receptive to coupons and price checks than virtually any other retailer. And that includes Amazon. A lot of people think Amazon's got this crazy price matching policy. They don't. There's not even a price matching policy in effect. I love Amazon. But for those of you that are shopping regularly at Walmart, you might not know that Walmart works well with certain cashback services. What you guys might have tried before is Rakuten, which is formerly Ebates. You'll type in Walmart and you're going to find there's no discount. And unless you're buying eBooks, no cash back. But what you might not know is if you will actually earn cash back for your grocery trips at Walmart. And it's as simple as just uploading your receipt. So all of the information and the way to make that happen is also available on mattsdailydeals.com. Walmart shopping secret number five. Did you know that for many electronic categories, when you do shop from Walmart online, you're not actually shopping from Walmart at all. And that could affect more than half the purchases you make. This is for all types of electronics. Let's look at TVs for an example. When you type in a TV to search for on Walmart, you're going to notice Walmart is very quick to tell you which televisions have free pickup and free delivery, but 
If you'll notice, a good chunk of the TVs that are coming up here have little disclaimers, which you might not notice on a quick search, especially if you're using an app, but this television is actually sold by Beach Camera. This is sold by Wholesale Values. This is sold and shipped by Electronic Express. Even though you're getting free delivery, it's not actually coming from Walmart. Walmart is acting as your shopping mall. They're facilitating the purchase. They're taking your money, applying it to a credit card, and then giving that money along to a different merchant from which they take a cut. That could actually affect your return policies with Walmart. Just because you feel comfortable with Walmart's return policy on a specific product, if it's a third party merchant, you actually have to get approval for the return in many cases from that third party. That's a little complicated with a large TV, but even on small scale purchases, let's look at infrared thermometers as an example. A lot of people are buying these right now. You're going to see that there's not one thermometer sold by Walmart on the entire screen. That's significant, right? These are not only marked up, but most of these products have no reviews and they're just coming from Chinese overseas merchants where you may not necessarily get your product. And if you do get your product, and I can't speak on behalf of everything right here, you'll have to be dealing with a third party. Not to give myself any specific shout outs, but on mattsdailydeals.com, I take a look at what people are shopping for and I make sure that they are domestic fulfillment on the products. So just keep that in mind when you are shopping, it's not always from Walmart, even though that's what the website says in your browser window. Shipping and saving secret number six. There is a stark difference between the prices you get in a Walmart physical store and a Walmart website. And usually the online prices are much better. Why? Well, price matching is very competitive online. Walmart understands that if you're shopping for a television or a brand they don't control, you can open up five browser windows, you can compare them to Amazon, Target, you can even use apps to help you find lower prices. When you're in a physical store, you're at the mercy of that retailer. You're not gonna drive around all of these different stores. And if you are going to open up your phone and start price matching, you put the control back in your hands. Walmart will price match any of the products that they offer in store to its own web prices. So you'll definitely want to know if an item is cheaper online. Saving secret number seven is you can save on gas if you use a Walmart gift card. What you might not know is Walmart has partnered with Murphy USA. And if there is a gas station near you, and this applies to your specific zip code, when you pay with a Walmart gift card, Walmart credit card, or Walmart MasterCard, you will find deals at a minimum of three cents per gallon when you fill up with a Walmart gift card at participating Murphy USA gas stations. Now this doesn't work for Murphy Express, doesn't work in Alabama, but this is worth knowing because there are different types of promotions that are sent out the Walmart gas discounts can really add up fast if we are at a time where oil is not doing what it is doing at the time at which I am recording and uploading this video. Saving secret number eight. When you're shopping at Walmart, if you buy the item online and then offer to pick it up in store, certain product categories have an additional savings that kicks in. That's called bonus pickup savings. So. If you read Walmart's terms and conditions, they offer you discounts on eligible online non-store items that you place an order for and ship to any Walmart store for pickup. And these discounts are displayed at checkout as a pickup discount. So all you need to do is you add the item with the pickup discount eligible to your cart at Walmart. And then upon checkout, you select pickup. On something like a large screen television that's not in stock at a Walmart, you may actually be able to lower your prices by 30 to $40 if the television is over 60 inches and you are not getting it delivered to your home. It depends on the item, the cost of freight, and what's going on at the time, but a lot of people don't know this quick trick. So again, I'm going to just say this slowly. If an item is not available in a store from Walmart and they have a ship to store option, in your zip code, ship the item to the Walmart store, go and pick it up, and it will appear in many cases as an extended eligible discount that you can then apply to your order. It's a two-step process, but it might be worth your while, especially because that cash can add up fast. I've tried this with a bunch of different zip codes. It depends on the day and the hour. And I was gonna show you some great examples right now, but I realized I'd just be infuriating certain people for that TV that's not available in your zip code and so on and so forth. Saving secret number nine. 
Items behind lock glass at Walmart are actually, in many cases, some of the least expensive products in the store. This goes against the typical mindset where if something's very valuable, you put it behind a glass lock at a museum, or when something's on display, if it's of a very hefty value or difficult to replace, we typically see it all locked up, right? The razor blades at CVS or Walgreens always behind glass, like the many other expensive products. But Walmart is a little bit different. They lock up products that are most likely to get stolen. And in some cases, those are very highly sought after inexpensive products and accessories that you could fit into your pocket. So sometimes keep in mind that if you're looking for a great budget pair of Bluetooth headphones, the Beats by Dre box might be readily available and something that you could grab with all sorts of theft detection built into the box. But another great pair of over the ear headphones that has none of that and no fancy box or packaging will actually be the pair that's locked up. That could actually affect the way that you shop for electronics more than you've ever thought. This does not apply to the Tide lockup and some of the other lockups you see in different products at Walmart. And for savings secret number 10, with my big finish, which I'm not usually known for, I want to give you one word that could forever change your shopping experience online on walmart.com. On their search bar, once you're on walmart.com and this does not work as well on the app, type in the word clearance. May take a few seconds, but this will bring up every single product that's actually at clearance pricing available on walmart.com. Now you may say to yourself, Granite, you've just given me a list of more than a thousand products. Well, that's fine. If you search through the categories that you now see available at the top on something like home improvement, it's searching from only within the clearance categories. If you want to nail it down to something very specific like paint, I know a lot of you are tackling home improvement projects, you're going to find everything in the paint aisle in terms of accessories and supplies that is reduced on clearance. If you go back, just to show you one more example, which I think is key, if you go back to the clearance section using that same parameter and you click on some of the TV deals, you're going to find prices that are so low, a regular web search wouldn't even generate a price for you unless you add this television to your cart. So this is the Samsung 55 inch class 4K Ultra HD. Let's add it to the cart and you will see this has a price of $449. At the time I'm recording this with this same web search, I can't find a price remotely close to that for a non-refurbished television. Checking Amazon, just as an example, not even close. So I hope that helped you save money. And this is just a little bit of what I could do at Walmart. Imagine if we build our bargains together at Target or Amazon or Best Buy or another store. It could be really fun. This is gonna be a part of a series that I do regularly on this channel. If you like what you saw, please subscribe, turn your notifications on, that way you'll know when I dispense my next big piece of deal advice. And if you have any insider secrets of your own that you wanna share, I found that I have the most awesome, well-informed viewers and subscribers, and the information that you post could be very helpful to someone else. So imagine how much money you could be saving another person you've never met or a soon-to-be very good online friend. We're stronger in numbers, and that's the whole point of being this big, happy, frugal family. I love you guys. Stay safe, stay healthy, and thanks for watching.